For many, this can be a tough time of year, and if a young person is struggling and might need help, they might be hesitant to make a phone call. Now there's a website youth can turn to for support. Here's V. Cooper. The uh, second leading cause of death amongst youth is suicide. That's right. After accidents, suicide is how we lose most of our young people. Hi, Need 2. Good morning. As the co-director of Need 2, Chris Holt wants to break the silence around this issue. You know, um, the Amanda Todd uh, issue came up and the campaign shifted immediately to bullying, you know, as opposed to actual youth suicide. So it's, it's all about the stigma, right? We just don't like to talk about it. But how can we reach youth to offer support? Where are we going to meet youth? Where, where are they? They're online, so let's go there. Because that's how youth communicate. Texting, tweeting, Facebooking, not talking on a phone. It can be really hard to, to go face to face with someone. It can be really hard to pick up the phone and, and find the words to, to talk to someone. So with the, the online support, it's a low risk sort of way to, to get connected to someone and, and talk about you know, what's going on and, and what to do. This is youthspace.ca, a website where those under 30 can reach out and get help at no charge. So you can chat in, you can text in. We also have the uh, forum where you can post on the forum, you know, something's going on and you just need to get it off your chest. You can post it there. Uh, others will respond to it. You'll hear back from the support team. That support team includes about 40 volunteers and professional counsellors who can then start a one-on-one -on -one email conversation with the youth. It's kind of neat not knowing who they are um, because then we can, we can stay objective and we can help them to see maybe things that they're not able to see sometimes because we're not too involved in their lives. And while this time of year is a hard time for many, it's during the school year with peer pressure, stress and anxiety about grades and social standing that youth space is busiest. Around this time of the year, maybe less because actually families are together and they may be talking. They may be arguing, but at least they're communicating, right? We really believe in the, the resiliency of, of all individuals, and especially our young people. They have the strength within themselves to figure out what they need to do. They know better than anyone else what, what's going on in their life. So we're really around to, to encourage that and to support them to find that strength within themselves. This check program is brought to you in part by Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.